you're not freaking broken. When did we start thinking that it was okay to use this language with ourselves? Whether it's out loud or internally, it doesn't matter. You're not broken. There's nothing broke about you. But sometimes we celebrate that. Why are we doing that? we got to stop. You're not broken. You're building. And there's a huge freaking difference. Let me tell you what's wrong with the concept of celebrating brokenness. It presumes that you're holding yourself accountable to a standard that is not your own. If you're doing that, you're not living your life. You're living someone else's, on someone else's terms. You most certainly are not living every minute. It doesn't matter if it's your parents or if it's another family member, it's your friends, your coworkers, or people you idolize, celebrities, I don't care who it is. It cannot be their standards. It can only be your own. It's your responsibility to figure out what your standards are for yourself. And if you're not measuring up, measure out and figure out how to get there. You're not broken, you're building. So build. Build a future that's better for yourself instead of celebrating your brokenness. It is an epidemic that is on a global scale where people's self-esteem is continually submarined because of the language that they use on themselves and with each other. If you know someone who talks like this, put your arm around them and tell them, you're not broke, you're building. And help them build something bigger for themselves. And you get to work building. I don't want to hear another person say, I'm broken. I'm broken and celebrate it like it's a good thing. Like all of a sudden it helps them belong to other broke people. You belong to whoever you want to belong to on your terms, always for the rest of your life. You don't need to use brokenness as a ticket to get into the club. Start your own freaking club. You're not broke. You're building. Start building right now.